Hey guys, so today I'm gonna do a let's get to know me tag. I feel like I haven't really ever gotten to know any of you, and I feel like you haven't gotten to know me. Um, so I felt like there was no better time than to do a get to know me tag. Uh, I wrote down a whole bunch of questions on my phone from other um, tags that I've seen. Uh, I hope that you like them and hope that they're informative. So the first question is, is, what is your name? Uh, my name is Wyatt Smith. I feel like I haven't really put that out there. So then that kind of goes into what are some of my nicknames. Um, well, well, when I was growing up, my nickname was YY. Um, just WYWY. I feel like that has kind of stuck around somewhat. I don't really have any true nicknames anymore, but if someone was going to call me a nickname, it would probably be YY. Such a silly nickname. Uh, and then the next question is, when is your birthday? My birthday is June 4th. Birthplace, I was born in Los Angeles, California. And your star sign, I am a Gemini. My occupation is, I am a makeup artist, as hopefully most of you know. And then my natural hair color, which is just my natural hair, is your hair length. Obviously, it's not too long. It's like an inch. And then the next question is, what is your best feature? I would say my best feature would be my teeth. I love my teeth so much. I take really good care of them. Um, I just feel like a good smile is like the best way to kind of like greet someone. What is your eye color? My eye color is blue, but sometimes it's gray and then sometimes it has like a hint of green in it. Have you ever had any piercings? Um, I've had a lot of piercings actually. Um, I've had both my ears pierced, and then I also gauged them. And then I also had an industrial on this side, an industrial on this side, and then I took both of them out, and then I got this one re-pierced, and then took that out again. Um, I had my septum pierced for a while, and I feel like there was more, but I don't think there were any more. Have you ever had any tattoos? I have one tattoo on my hip. Are you right or left-handed? I'm right-handed, that's why I'm holding my phone. I'm all right hand. And then, when, when did you have your first best friend? Uh, I would say my first best friend was in fifth grade. Um, I lived in a super small town. Um, but her name was Brittany. We were like really good friends and we were sneaky. We were super sneaky. It was like the best friendship ever. Um, we like we would talk on the phone all the time. Like literally one time we stayed on the phone from when school got out until school started the next day. So we talked on the phone from like three in the afternoon all night long until like 7.30 in the morning. Just about like everything and nothing all at the same time. Um, but we would play tricks on people and we would just be like catty bitches. It was the best. What was the first award you ever won? I would say still back in that day, my first award was kind of, um, during track season. I used to run a really, really good 400. Um, I would say that was my first award. So well. first sport was probably like peewee soccer, peewee t-ball. Those were my first sports back in the day when I was like five. And first real holiday, I would say my first real holiday was probably Christmas. And um, the first real one that I remember is going to like Mexico. I feel like that was like at the age where Christmas kind of was still like a surprise, but we were kind of growing out of um, knowing that Santa was real. So my parents kind of like took me and my brother to Mexico to kind of make us kind of believe in like Santa a little bit longer. Yeah, favorite movie? I would say my favorite movie would be... I would say Wally. I love that movie. I think it's adorable and cute and um, that's like the same word. But I just like, I think it has a good meaning behind it. The song probably right now is um, the new Miley Cyrus song. We can't stop. 
but that's that's neither here nor there. Favorite food is Chinese food. I absolutely love Chinese food. If I could eat Chinese food every single day, I totally would. Favorite book? Uh, favorite book is probably Da Vinci Code. I love Dan Brown. I think he writes really well. I think it's interesting how he like incorporates like um, actual like artifacts with like his stories that are all like. Like, basically keeping fiction and non-fiction, like, in one book. I think it's awesome. Uh, favorite magazine? I like... Like, I'm looking over to, like, where I have my magazines. Like, Vogue. I love Vogue just because it has, um, great pictures of, like, on-trend, like, makeup and stuff like that. Any magazine that is, like, fashion-oriented is probably what I would pick up if I was gonna pick up magazines, but I don't pick them up very often. Favorite shoes? I love Clarks, like, just cause they're like casual boots that you could wear any time of the year and still be like comfortable where they wouldn't be too hot or too cold or whatever. Um, I don't have any right now, I don't think. Nope, I don't have any right now cause my dogs chewed them up, but hopefully this, this winter I'll pick up a couple new pairs. Are you single or are you taken? Well, right now I'm single, um, but it would be nice to be taken. I would like that. Are you currently eating anything? Um, no. Uh, what are you currently listening to? One, I'm listening to all the traffic go by my window. I normally have music on, so it's weird to hear actual cars, but if I was listening to music, it would be like, like, I don't know, pretty lights or something just kind of like mellow. Uh, what are you watching? Um, right now I'm actually watching, um, Titanic, out on my TV, it's still on over there. It's not playing, but it's on. I watched like the first 48 minutes of it, and then I paused it to go get a snack, and realized that I only had watched 48 minutes of it, and there's like another two and a half hours. So I decided to film this video instead. Just Currently wearing, what am I wearing? I'm wearing a neon yellow hat, just because I thought it was super cute, and it's um, I don't know. It's just fun. Like, why don't you, why not just wear a giant neon hat? And I'm wearing a new shirt that I got at H&M. Um, it's super comfy. And then I'm wearing, um, just some sweatpants shorts because you guys normally don't see them. So I'm just gonna... Do you want children? Uh, I would say in this future it would be nice to have children. I think it'd be fun to be a dad. I've always liked hanging out with kids and, um... Kids always seem to like me, so I think that someday kids would be a good, a good addition to my life. And then same kind of question is, would you ever want to be married? Most definitely. I think that most people want to get married, but some people don't. But I, I would like to get married. I think that would be nice to have someone that you can say is yours and they are, or and you are theirs. And um, I just like the idea of having a marriage. Careers in mind, I would like to stick with being a makeup artist. Um, it's just something that I'm extremely passionate about and I love the experience of doing someone's makeup because you can change someone from not feeling good about themselves to feeling fantastic about themselves in like an hour. And um, just seeing all of the expressions and all of the emotions that have come up for me just doing someone's makeup kind of amaze me just because you can make someone's complete like not even like not even just their day you can make their whole life like just teaching them a couple of tricks or just doing their makeup and making them feel so much better about themselves i love doing makeup and i don't think i could ever do anything else um, where do you want to live um that's a hard question because i haven't been everywhere you know there's so many places that i've never been so i don't really know what the best answer could be, but as of now, I think living in like Los Angeles or Washington State, so like Seattle or New York or somewhere like that where it's like busy and always going. And I feel like right now, like I love where I live now, but it's very slow, but I think that I need a little bit more push in the future. Do you believe in love at first sight? I do not. Um, 
I feel like it takes a long time for me to trust someone enough to even feel love towards them. So I don't feel like love at first sight would even be a possibility. But, um, like lust or like liking someone at first sight, I feel like being attracted to them at first sight could be like a real, like, a, like an answer for me. But that could grow into love, but I wouldn't say that I would like instantly know that I love them and they love me and happily ever after. I don't think that that would happen. And then, do you believe in ghosts? I most certainly do believe in ghosts. I used to live in a house that had ghosts and um, he would stand like in my doorway and just like stare into my room if my door was open. <coughs> um, I remember one time I had my my desk on the opposite side of where my door was and I could just feel someone or something um, like staring into my like person. So I turn around and there was just this like figure just standing there in the doorway. It was terrifying. Um, I thought I was crazy until my friends saw the same thing. But anyway, I do believe in ghosts. The next question is, do you believe in aliens? I do believe in aliens, but I don't believe in them as in like aliens that are going to come down to the earth and like attack us or abduct us. I believe that there are other life forms out in the universe because it's so big there has to be something else. Uh, kissing on the first date, I feel like that's okay. Depending on the person, depending on how everything goes, but I feel like it shouldn't be such like this drawn out thing and so awkward. I feel like if you have held someone's hand for a full movie, I feel like just kissing them wouldn't be that big of a deal, you know what I mean? Like, if the mood is there, if the atmosphere is there, just do it and don't make it such like a, I don't know, like hesitant thing, just do it. Do you believe in yourself? I do believe in myself. Um, I wouldn't be here today if I didn't believe in myself. I've had to prove to myself that I I need to be here, I guess. Like it's, it's a really hard thing to kind of describe to you quickly, but I do believe in myself 100% because you have to, I think, because if you don't, then you don't know where to go. So there, I do believe in myself. So hopefully that helped get you, you guys to know me a little bit better and hopefully it helped kind of um, answer some unknown questions about me. If there's anything else you want to know, comment down below. But if you want to kind of get to know me a little bit more, you can always follow me on Instagram, which the link will be down below. Um, other than that, I hope you have a great day or night, depending on when you're watching this, and I'll see you guys soon.